Now, I know Man United were your, your boyhood heroes. You wouldn't want to upset them twice in a season, would you? Uh, once I step uh, past that right line, um, it's not. <laughs> I don't look at it like that. I just go out and perform for 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 the team and the fans. So that goes out the window until the end of the game. Even if it means they don't qualify for Europe. Even if it means that. <laughs> <laughs> that goal that you scored um, was memorable in many ways. But for you, it must be almost the biggest moment of your career. Would that be fair? Yeah, I'll say that. Um, it's the goal that gave me the platform in the Premier League and and allowed me to, to get as much games I think I'm, as I'm getting now. Um, so it was a good moment. Um, it's a shame I can't remember a lot of I can't remember a lot about it because my mind what kinda went blank after I scored, so I think most Albion fans could probably talk you through. It was Morgan who laid it back to you. <laughs> Which foot was it left? <laughs> yeah, it was a left. You, you yeah, remember I, I, I've, I've watched the video but I mean Live, I can't remember me hitting me and then running away and celebrating the way I did, because uh, my like like as soon as Cess passed it, as the ball come to me as I sh- distracted, just my mind went totally blank, so I, I couldn't remember much. I don't know that it was sort of bedlam afterwards, but you've you've since taken stock of the fact that that was our first win there in thirty five years, and obviously a lot of pe- people must have spoken to you about it. Yeah, yeah, um, few fans that I've met outside the club have kind of said it, so. It's kind of sank in now. I think after the game, I think the whole team didn't really, wasn't really aware of what we just achieved. But um, as time went by, we just put it on the side and then we just carried on doing our job. Now we all know that's only one of four wins that, that have come this season. It's important that now we sort of don't look too much at that, that historic win and, and look ahead to this weekend and focusing on getting a good result on Saturday. Yeah, exactly. Um, you know the boys. The boys know the tough, the tough uh, games we've got ahead of us. Um, I think that 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 victory was put behind a long time ago. Uh, we we're now got eleven games left, and we all staying together as a unit, uh, working under Pep Mel, uh, supporting him fully, and um, we we got to ensure that we finish the job well. Are there elements of that game though that you can look upon in terms of building the confidence of the players? Because many of the players that will play on Saturday played in that game. You know, th- there's no reason why you can't do the same again. Yeah, exactly. That gave us a big confident boost. Um, and and when when we're working on the training pitches, we we will have sort of memories, and we will I think we'll go in the game feeling confident, especially with our home record at home. So I don't think none of the boys got fear when it, when we're playing at home. So. We'll build on, on, we'll build on, from uh, from our, our home games that we've had recently, and we'll look to get that the win that we need, that we all desperately need. Good try. Oh! Oh!